Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the channel. Once again, welcome to the delayed flight. Uh, this clip is about this annoying bar. It is about this one here. And uh, wh what is the problem, actually? Uh, first of all, it needs seconds to disappear. And uh, if, for instance, I want to change my camera views, because now we are actually uh, watching a landing, and I put the cursor somewhere here, you see, it appears again, and if you're close to the bar, all the icons of the bar appear. And of course, this is annoying. I see this in uh, many clips, of course, not only mine. Even if you change the mode, it doesn't leave, for instance, here. And you have to Okay, you have to wait some seconds. This this is actually quite annoying and the truth is that I didn't know, no matter what you do, always the bar appears. Let us have a look at the, this wonderful landing. Let us have a look just a second, please. So, uh, the question is how we can get rid of this uh, annoying bar. And uh, I saw in some forums that actually there is a tool that uh, can take this annoying bar away yeah of course uh, we we saw a clip with this landing earlier isn't it i think it was one of the last clips you see no matter what the mode is if it is the drone camera mode or if it is the external camera mode here or if it is inside the cockpit as soon as you put the cursor the bar appears and it needs seconds to disappear so there is a toolbar in flight simto that promises to us that we can get rid of this bar so let us have a try let us have a try and let us watch the whole procedure and let us hope that it will be successful so we go to flightsim.to and we search for ether no handlebar so it seems it is this one here you go here to download i have already downloaded the file you press download i suppose you have an account uh, on flight simto and you just download the file you set the file on your desktop isn't it this is the file here and then you extract So this is our file here, extracted. And then you go to your community folder. There are plenty of tutorials uh, concerning the community folder. So I suppose you know where your community folder is. Here I created a shortcut. And you just take this file and you drag it here inside. Or if you prefer, you can cut and paste or copy and paste. It seems I didn't add the file in my community folder. I don't see it here alphabetically. So we just take the file and we place it inside our community folder. Yeah, exactly. Here it is now. Okay. Please pay attention. This is quite important. Uh, always when you proceed to downloads and so on, and installations inside your community folder uh, you are out of the game okay you're out of the game and then you log on again so the truth is that i disconnected from microsoft flight simulator and now that we have this file inside our community folder i will log on again let us return to our airport kefalonia airport greece so i think everything is just excellent you see only if i put the cursor here appears the bar but if i move the cursor everywhere else isn't it or if i click with the mouse it disappeared so 
mission accomplished. Even when I change camera views, use the cockpit commands, you see, now I can move with the cursor. The wings, for instance, and uh, the bar didn't appear. If we check this mode, the external camera, also we see that I can press left and right click and uh, it doesn't appear. And if we go to drone mode here, only you see if I go here, uh, actually higher than the, the bar, only if I'm higher than the bar, the bar appears. Everywhere else, not. So indeed it was a wonderful add-on. Let us test our new add-on once again. Wonderful camera views and the weather helps a lot. Wonderful visibility. So, as you see, I move the cursor and uh, the bar doesn't appear. Only if I go here, higher than the bar, the bar appears. Okay, and actually it disappears much more faster, immediately. This is also good. Uh, before the add-on we needed about, uh, let's say, 3-4 seconds. Yeah, uh, wonderful landing, wonderful add-on, wonderful time to record this landing see nothing appears only if I go here and immediately it disappears if I move the cursor it works with all the modes isn't it external camera inside the cockpit and also it works excellent with the drone mode here I set my drone camera and it is a wonderful view You see I move the cursor and only above the bar it appears. So ladies and gentlemen, uh, this was the add-on I wanted to show you, an excellent tool, a freeware from Flight SimTO. Just go to Google or type either no handlebar or go directly to flightsim.to and uh, type no handlebar and then I showed you how to download uh, this file. Ladies and gentlemen, I think this is all for now. I'm very glad that I managed to install live actually uh, this new add-on. Thank you for watching this clip and hope to see you soon to the next one. Till then, you take care and bye for now.